Don Lester. Now four dollars actually. Woodside Jester at four eighty. All placed away. Green light on. No more bets. Heavily back to Hopes Bay Box two. Set. Away, began well up there vying for the lead. Keander and Stalking Storm tried to match it, but Hopes Bow got clear. Stalking Storm in the second, Keander third. Then behind those getting up on the inside was Woodside Jester, but about six lengths from this leader. The others are too far back. They're bunched up. Dagwood, uh, Mr. Dagwood, Lockerall back there also. But in front, it's Hopes Bow going strong, and it's going to hold on. Hopes Bow wins, beat Stalking Storm. Third, Keandra. Fourth placing Woodside Jester. Don Lester making some ground late, but was never really in it. And the other three always. Always at the tail end of the field, Mr. Dag Woodlock and Phantom Hawk. The time around 22.54. Two beats, three and one. Two, three, one. 22.54. Means up at a double for Cameron Butcher and well-supported favourite Hopes Bow to take out the final event on the programme. Two, three, one and six. Two, three, one, six. 22.54 the time. 7.15 was the early split, then 10.10, and the run home was 12.44. Favourite punters were pretty excited after about four or five steps, or hopes bow out in front, and hard to catch. The danger was Stalking Storm, who was close but couldn't quite run down hopes bow. Got within a length on the line, one by three and a half. Uh, Blue Dog April 2015, collision out of hopes up. Raced by CMY Butcher, Cameron Butcher, the winning trainer.